addictions. Definitely the biggest thing that is happening in 2020. So many people have been developing so many addictions, uh, especially why there's not a lot of things to do in 2020. So addictions is, you know, the best thing probably right now. Hi, I'm Johnny Depp. Uh, wait, what? No, no I... <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 no, I, I, I am not Johnny Depp, uh, why, I don't know why I said I'm Johnny Depp, I'm Tommy Hilfiger, they have similar names, Tommy Hilfiger, Johnny Depp, but, yeah, well, Johnny Depp is actually my brother, I just revealed it, I was gonna make a whole other video revealing, but I, I just revealed it, but, anyway, what's going on guys, I'm Tommy Hilfiger, welcome back to the therapy show, but today we're gonna be talking about how you can stop your addictions, right now in the background, there is a man that is addicted to eating chocolate, and he just cannot stop it, there, oh, you know, a lot of people just say, just stop, just, no, and this is what people say whenever someone goes and like, I can't stop my addiction, and then those other people say, well, just, just stop doing it, just stop doing it, and over time, you'll just, develop something else and you will not have an addiction well those people tell big fat lies that is not how you stop an addiction because today i tommy hilfiger the best therapist in town in the world get that right i will tell you how you stop it uh stop a addiction so let's get started so yeah this pretty much happens to everyone at least everyone has had an addiction in their life for example i have had a a lot of addictions. For example, I have an addiction for just roasting the, uh, the extra math guy. But I mean, it's an addiction that I, I just love doing. I mean, look at this guy. He looks like an egg. He literally, he looks like an egg. Okay, is this really going to be another video just roasting the extra math guy? Okay, let me just tell you how you can stop your addictions. Now, there are different type of addictions that you have, and there's going to be different ways to solve one, solve them. For example, if you're addicted to playing video games, that's all right if you're addicted to playing video games. Pretty much every single person are addicted to video games. If you like video games, you're probably addicted, probably addicted to Fortnite. But that's like, that's just, that can be fixed. That can just like simply be fixed. Like, your parents can just take away your console, and then over time, and then... Yeah. I don't know why I'm laughing, but still, honestly, just looking at the background, I kind of want that chocolate. No, I'm going to develop an addiction. I'm going to develop an addiction. Yeah. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. So video games, yeah, that's something that's, that's not bad. There's a lot of other addictions. For example, eating chocolate. If you eat chocolate, you're going to get fat. You're just going to and get fat. I know I'm gonna see a bunch of comments roasting me that I'm fat. I've already seen a bunch. Actually, I haven't seen a bunch, so thank you for being nice to me. <laughs> thank you for being nice to me. But yeah, anyway, I, I, mean, I keep getting off topic. Yeah, for example, eating chocolate, you'll like get fat. Video games, that just gives you, that just gives you a, a brain ache. And I mean, I guess if it's summer, I mean, I guess it's fine. Yeah, that just gives you a brain ache and then just makes you dumb. That's not really a, a problem at the moment. So yeah, there's a lot of things some I'm not going to talk about because I, I just don't want to. There's just a lot of addictions in the world bad ones there's good ones like playing video games even though that's probably a bad one so keep playing video games there's the best addiction which is roasting the extra math guy and yeah but you know you know you know people people say that addictions are good people say like like people who want addiction to stop are stupid like they're stupid they're stupid they're stupid well is that an insult are you calling me stupid Okay, listen, no. We're going to sell this right now. Schedule a boxing appointment. I'll just slide the extra mad boxing appointment. I want to box you. If you think that I'm an idiot, come on, let's fight, man. Let's fight. Let's fight. Let's fight. Let's fight. Uh. <sighs> okay, anyway, yeah, so addictions, like, yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, people say that you know addictions are fine and you know like whenever they're like parents just say stop 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 just stop your addiction and then they're like no and then like literally they just say they're gonna do something 
and they never do it. So that that happens. But you know, yeah, people, you know, they do, you know, people, yeah, they don't want like they don't like it. And some celebrities don't even mind or anyone don't no one even minds about addictions. There are a lot of addictions in the world. There's only one celebrity that minds this. You know what celebrity it is? You guessed it. It's the one and only Johnny Depp. That's right. Johnny Depp actually like he actually he actually says addictions are bad for you yeah i mean it's it's true like if you don't listen to um uh, jonathan christopher depp then you're just wrong you, you're just wrong if you don't even know who this guy is then i, I just need you i think I, I think you need some help i think you need to attend my therapy show but yeah he doesn't even like addictions and like literally he he, he hates everything like yeah he literally hates everything he hates um people yeah yeah but he actually likes addiction so yeah but anyway back to the you know whole how to overcome your addiction thing so yeah so let's start with one addiction like eating chocolate eating chocolate i know it's just so addicting chocolate is like literally the best now how do you stop your addiction to eating chocolate this is how you stop your addiction to eating chocolate We ban chocolate from the U.S. and then everything's fixed. Take that, Trump. Speaking of Donald Trump, Trump actually has an addiction. I know, crazy. But, you know, you know, a lot of people, you know, it's obvious. Like, everyone talks about Trump's addiction, but they don't even know that he has his addiction. You know what his addiction is? His addiction is being dumb. Like, he can't actually be smart, like, like. His addiction is being dumb. Like he's just always dumb. Like, yeah. Like he 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 just he's just he's just dumb. Like he doesn't think right. Like, like that's an addiction of his. Like he can't stop being dumb. That's an addiction. You see, there's different type of addictions. Like ones that don't even make sense. Like Trumps. And yeah, let me just talk about, uh, you know, other people famous that they have secret addictions that you don't even know about. For example, on the right side, there's Fat Chris Pratt, and then look on the left side, left side, that's good Chris Pratt. Like, can you see? He had an addiction to eating so much chocolate, and now, now, look at him. Like, I don't know, maybe it's like, in a matter of three years, he overcame that addiction. See? And now, let me tell you about some other ones, and uh, yeah, how they uh, overcame it. For example, look at Chris Evans over here. This is him in the year 2000, and uh, compare him to now in Avengers Endgame. Like, I mean, look how much he, uh, you know, changed. Like, like literally, like he overcame the addiction of b being skinny, and, and he, yeah, he actually, he actually, you know, turned out to be the, the Captain America. I don't really know what else to say. Can you see now how people overcame their addictions and actually just stopped doing it? That's all you have to do. Stop doing it not just relax or meditate but that, that's a good thing i don't know if you guys even meditated did you guys meditate in the last video if you did you're a true fan if you meditated you're a true fan good job hi hola como estas amigo but anyway can you see how people overcame their addictions and you know actually turned out to do things that they wanted to do instead of being lazy that is how you over you overcome your addiction but it takes many time it took many time for Chris Pratt it took like what two years I think it took two years yeah it took him like uh, no not two years yeah I don't know how long it took him it just took him a while so it's gonna take you a while but once you actually start doing it and you just and stop doing the the thing like for example, stop staying lazy and then you actually get up and do something productive. That is how you overcome it. And then over time, you just like, oh, lay down and, and like your friends like, oh, you want to lay down in the bed? And then they're like, no, nah, I'm good. Yeah. So yeah, that is how you overcome your addictions. If you guys enjoy, make sure to leave a like on the video and I will see you guys next. What is that echo? What is wrong with you? Um... <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like this video is just getting way too long, but wait, don't click off the video yet. Just make sure, guys, you subscribe, share, and like the video with notification bells. Or well, you're going to be looking as sad as this guy. No one wants to look as sad as this guy because he's ugly and he cries like a baby because he is. And oh, did you notice the pimple? Wow.
Okay, yeah, anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Please sub, like, and share, and I'll see you guys in the next one. <sighs> Ugh, I don't know how to outro this. Okay, sub, like, and share. Okay, bye. His name is John C. <laughs> It's on